how many people have shown up to celebrate this amazing teacher at North Shore Elementary. His classroom is right there. Are we ready to do this? Absolutely. Okay, let's go, let's go. Let's get this door open. Let's get surprising. A very, very special educator. Can you peek into his classroom there? Oh, oh, he's, I think he's seen. I think he, I don't know if he knows what's going on. Mr. Russell! Mr. Russell! Hello! Surprise! <laughs> we are here to celebrate you as an amazing educator here at North Shore Elementary. Okay. All these people said you're amazing. Oh, thank you. I love what I do, and I love the place that I work at, and I'm, I know I'm surrounded by people who care about our students and their teachers, so I'm, uh, this is my seventh year here now, so and I enjoy working here. Oh my goodness. Guys, do you love Mr. Rosso? Is he a great teacher? You know, um, I really don't enjoy the public praise, you know, um, but I, like I said, I love what I do. I love what I get to do with the kids uh, to try to reach and, and uh, so they can reach their full potential. So I, I enjoy what I do. So, uh, uh, yeah, uh, nervous. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you say you don't like the public attention, but you're on Houston Life now. You're on KPRC. Oh. You're on TV. <laughs> What I think is interesting is you didn't always know you were going to be a teacher. You didn't know you wanted to be a teacher. Tell us about your journey into teaching. No. So when I started, um, I didn't know I wanted to do it. So I started off working at Junior Achievement. And then uh, that program focused on financial literacy. So once I started volunteering for them, that's when I knew, OK, I, I think I want to give this a try. So uh, this is my 11th year now in education. So I've, I've, it was a very difficult start for me, but you know, as the years have gone by, it's been easier, smoother, and I felt like I've, I've um, become an expert in my content area. So it's, it's, it's been a good journey. Well, you know what, you guys, I just think teachers are unsung heroes and it's been amazing honouring so many amazing educators in Houston this week. You're just another great educator that we're adding to our list and I would like to get Tracy from Shell Federal Credit Union to come and present just a little token of our appreciation for the amazing work you do for our next generation. Absolutely. Thank you for being an inspiration to so many people. And we have a gift basket for you and a $250 gift card to put some money back in your pocket. Thank you so much. <laughs> okay, so I heard that there is a thing that Mr. Rasso does every morning with you guys. There's a special song that you guys sing. Tell us about this special song that you sing every morning for your, for your kiddos. So I know one of the biggest things uh, is to build classroom community. So uh, every day, most of the days, um, I put this Shaka Khan song that goes, tell me something good. It's like a 15 second song and then that just creates that uh, relationship with the students where it's um, not based on um, education. So I just ask them and they tell me, oh, my mom cooked, you know, some tacos yesterday or whatever. <laughs> and then so that I can build that relationship with them, you know, I ask them, oh, you know, well, what did you have to drink with your tacos? Or So it's just that small conversation that builds those strong relationships with the students. And that's, that's what we do, so. Do you guys want to do a special version of the Tell Me Something Good song where you, you tell me something good about Mr. Rasso? Yeah! Okay! Who wants to go first? You've got your hands up. You weren't, you weren't ready? So, tell me something good about Mr. Rasso. Mr. Rasso always lets us play um, Blook It and Kahoot sometimes. He always teach me something new. Learn math and science. He teaches us to learn things that we don't know. Mr. Russell's a very cool teacher and I like his personality and smile. He is nice and he is kind. He's really funny and nice and he teaches us new things. You guys are a bilingual class, aren't you? Because Mr. Russell speaks both English and Spanish. Would you like to tell us something good about Mr. Rosso in Spanish? Yes. She is 
Eres amable y nos enseñas cosas nuevas y nos, ahorita estamos a punto de aprender de ciencia de float and sync. He says, I'm kind, funny, um, nice person, and we're going to learn about sync and float during our science blog today. How does it feel to have your students talk about you like this? Oh, it feels good, even though, you know, sometimes we have days where we're focused on learning, you know, so it's good to hear that they enjoy it. Um, I do try to be silly sometimes to try to, you know, have a good day with them and, and, and make it fun. I have to say that Mr. Rasso is an amazing teacher. He's not only a role model and inspiration for his students, but also for his colleagues and the whole community alike. I mean, he is amazing. This is a well-deserved um, recognition for him, and we are very proud of him. So another thing that Mr. Rasso does in this class is called the Tortilla Club, is that right? Can you explain what that is? A tortilla clap is like whenever a student gets something really good and correct and he tells the whole class to do a tortilla clap to congratulate them. Oh my goodness, should we do a tortilla clap for Mr. Rosso, everybody? All right, let's do it. Very nice. Congratulations and a big shout out to all the students watching Houston Life today at North Shore Elementary School in Galena Park ISD. And once again, congrats to Mr. Razo. And a huge thanks to the team from Shell Federal Credit Union for teaming up with us all week long to celebrate some of our deserving teachers at Shell. They are committed to supporting schools and educators around Houston. And uh, as we've been reminding you all week long, please give those educators in your lives a shout out on our website, HoustonLife.tv. Just look for the We Love Teachers section right there on the homepage.